Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We are pleased to have the annual Indo <coughs> Chennai Japan Film Festival, like previous years, thanks to the support given by the local Council General, as well as the other officials who are, being, who are always associating, associating with Indo Senior Appreciation Foundation for organizing this program. We are happy to have a houseful show for this program. Now, on behalf of Indo Senior Appreciation Foundation, I request our President Mr. Kannan to welcome the guests by garlanding them. I request him to garland the council general. I, I request him to garland Mr. J. V. K. J. Kudi, the our chief guest on this occasion. I request him to garland Ms. Kuti Patmi, our advisor for the Chennai Festival as well as ICM. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sir. May I now request the Council General to give his inaugural address. I'd like to thank the Tagore Film Center for such a nice venue for showing films. And also, I'd like to thank Indo Cine Appreciation Foundation for helping us organize this film festival. And of course, I would like to thank each and every one of you for coming here tonight for this opening night of our film festival. Thank you very much to, to you all. Tonight, uh, we're going to, sh uh, for, uh, sorry, for the next three days, we're going to show uh, Japanese films. And tonight, uh, we're going to show a film titled, uh, my, oh, sorry, <laughs> His Master's Voice. And uh, it's in its originally, uh, original Japanese uh, title, it's called Mouichito, meaning, once again, and you will find out what it means in this film as the story unfolds. <coughs> the, story, the story is about the uh, relationship between a young boy and uh, a, fo a former Lakumoka or comic storyteller. In this film, this main character, Lakumoka, is played by a real life storyteller. So the main character is played by actual a uh, professional storyteller. And Nakugo, some of you may know, that is the uh, traditional uh, Japanese art of storytelling and dates back to the Edo period, early 17th century to 
uh, mid 19th century. And the film is set in uh, this period, just before Japan opened its doors to the outside world. You get a glimpse of the life of the ordinary people in those days. And by the time the film ends, you will be uh, more familiar with Rakugo and uh, you will understand why it is still popular even today in Japan. And I hope you will enjoy the film tonight. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.